He did. And last but not least, and I, I'm checking for an update now, uh, there's a couple of programmers who came up with a genius idea. Um, over at uh, twitch.tv slash Twitch Plays Pokemon. <laughs> I uh, went to there they, today. What's that? I went there today, and I, my eyes were, like, going buggy. Yeah, it, it's amazing. <laughs> uh, what they did is they, uh, they programmed an IRC chat client to interact with a uh, Game Boy emulator. To the point where uh, the chat room of the video is controlling the movement of the Pokemon game. Now, this is a cool concept, but it doesn't really work out all that great. No. Because it ends up, I mean, for the most part, every time I've watched it, they're just going back and forth in the menu. And, yeah, exactly. Uh, looking, looking left and right. <laughs> um, now, there is a lag in uh, response time, as there obviously should be. But the thing is getting crazy hits. I mean, in five days, it's gotten just under 12 million viewers. And currently, there are 88,000 people playing this game. It's insane. Wow. So, and it, it, the awesome thing is it shows you on the screen uh, the chat commands going into the Game Boy emulator. So you can see what moves are coming up. Um, but, I, I mean, it, it's a horrible, horrible execution just because you have 88,000 people trying to control this. It's thing. a great thing yeah. if it's secret, right? I mean, and yeah. Because, I, yeah, I, I jumped in earlier today. I was like, oh, I guess I should get on, on off hours. There's probably no off peak hours on this thing anymore. <laughs> no, even at 8 o'clock in the morning, it. at 8 o'clock in the morning, there were still 30,000 people controlling. It's amazing. I, I'm amazed it hasn't crashed yet, just from over. I know. The one, the one thing I was uh, wondering about, I didn't, I, I saw that they had like the, the um, democracy and anarchy thing. I wasn't sure what that was about. Do you know what, anything about that? Where? At? In the chat, like people As, were yeah, typing they're, they're anarchy it. and democracy. Oh, they're trying. People have been trying to uh, figure out a way to cooperate with each other to actually get stuff done. Oh, okay. Um, but the problem with that is that takes away the entire social interactive of the game. Mm -hmm. Because if you break it down to everybody trying to agreeing on what you're doing, then you might as well just have one person controlling the game. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. And if you want that, then you need to log off the internet and go pick up your Game Boy and play the game. Yep, play yourself. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> But, I, I mean, it, it's awesome that someone sat down and thought about doing this. It, and it's fun to watch. And I, I'm curious to see uh, how long it would, uh, it, how long it'll go on. I gotta say, it's pretty simple, because there's only, what, like, there's very few inputs. Because it's a Game Boy game, right? So there's, eight. like, BA, select, start, and the directions. Yeah, so, eight, eight total. Yeah, so you just have to interface that, and then that's... You know, that's it. Um, and I imagine as far as it crashing, they probably have something that's kind of gauging and flowing it into the game. Like there's a stop, like a dam, you know, I mean, right. to, to push those through. Um, but uh, uh, the funny, the funniest thing I've seen so far is screenshots of uh, people actually accidentally releasing Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> because no. it, you have all these people controlling it. And the controls will get you places. Mm -hmm. So you'll act. Uh, someone will hit start, and it'll access the Pokemon menu. And because other people aren't paying attention to what's going on, it the Pokemon gets released. And I, like I say, what we're showing now to you guys here live on the stream, and and, and what you're going to see later here on video. Uh, this is this is live. This is what's happening right now. That's how quick <laughs> it's going. This isn't a replay or anything like that. That's what's happening here on Tuesday night uh, as far as this chat room goes. And you see them walking around selecting emails. You see it flying by on the right there wonder, in the video. I wonder how many times they've saved the game. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's amazing. But, uh, it, yeah, it's just a really cool idea, and I'm glad someone did it. Just to see what happened. Mm -hmm. And awesome. they did. <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. And exactly what happened 
is it's a clusterfuck. <laughs> <laughs> you have you have seventy five hundred people trying to go left, and seventy five hundred people trying to go right, and then the rest are all hitting random commands. Wow. All right. Well, we're so, gonna move on to our next story.